I'm going to school up north and I just found that I'm super unprepared for dressing for the cold so I decided to style some outfits that hopefully will keep me warm throughout this winter and are still kind of cute ideally. So hopefully you guys get some inspiration. Let's go. Before we begin, I just wanted to give a little PSA. So I'm a freshman in college and I just got back my first semester. I had so much fun. I met so many cool people. I traveled, I ate really good food, like just amazing time. And when I got home, I was super excited because I was kind of able to shift from my fall wardrobe and then transfer to like my winter wardrobe that I was gonna take up to school for the second semester. And I found that like trying some of my pants on specifically, I was like, wow, these do not fit. Like these are tight, these I can't button, whatever. And at first I was like, oh man, that sucks. And then I was like, why is that a thing? I had such a good time. It was my first time living on my own. I took good care of myself. I'm just growing up and that's completely normal. And you're not gonna have the same body type that you did when you're a teenager versus in your 20s versus in your 30s, whatever. It makes sense that the jeans that fit me sophomore year are probably not gonna fit my freshman year of college. So just if any of you guys are kind of like struggling with this or or have just like thought about it too you're not alone it happens to the best of us and i decided you know what i'm gonna not bring those pants that don't fit i'm not gonna make it like a goal to fit into them i'm gonna continue to live my life and wear clothes that fit and that's that so that being said let's start the video so this first outfit is just a really good like base outfit to begin with because it's like you can style it a bunch of different ways these jeans are my newest obsession it's cool carhartt kind of like carpenter jeans they're so cute they're so comfortable and baggy and i love them this hoodie is thrifted i feel like you guys have seen it a million times and then kind of to accessorize the first way that i would do it is with some sort of hat this used to be my favorite hat before i shaved my head and i think that maybe I will not wear baseball caps with a shaved head because I just feel like it needs like hair flowing out of it. I don't know. But anyway, depending on the temperature, you could either go with a little puffer vest. Of course, they're not always realistic because it's going to be freezing at some point. So that leaves our other option, which is just a nice black puffer. This one's by Misguided, but I clipped it from Buffalo Exchange. This would definitely just keep you a lot warmer. And of course, if it's freezing, I'd probably wear like a thermal under this. Maybe even a pair of thermal leggings under my jeans if it's that cold. But another way to style this would be with some sort of like varsity jacket or bomber jacket situation this is actually my dad's old varsity jacket that i just think is so cool but it's honestly so so thick and warm it's another alternative is some sort of like flannel this one actually has this like crazy fur in it so this flannel jacket is super cool because it has just this like nice little fuzzy fur in the inside that just keeps you so incredibly warm honestly i'm sweating in it right now but in the cold i know it'd be perfect the next outfit that we're starting with i got these cargo pants for christmas as well how cute they are i just love this kind of like greenish gray color and again they're just super loose around the waist which is just nice because not only is it great for layering but also just comfort is the most important thing and this black long sleeve i just recently thrifted and i feel like it's just like such a good base piece personally i would definitely style this with some sort of nice race car tee this is just one of my many race car shirts but i think this would probably like go best color wise and then if it's cold i would just throw on my trusty puffer for this next base outfit i've got these faux leather pants that are from toby i really like that they're straight legs I'm wearing these little heeled boots from Boohoo and then my black turtleneck is thrifted. First way you can style this outfit, I've got this really cool little like mesh kind of button up that is from eBay, but it's by Forever 21. I really like how this top is sort of boxier and also cropped. It's obviously not adding that much warmth. So now that we've got this, we have two options for jackets. Trial one is this leather jacket and I don't know, I'm not sure how I feel about it. It's definitely a really nice jacket because it is like quilted and heavy so it's gonna keep me pretty warm the other option we have is of course the black puffer so i actually i'm gonna try it unbuttoned if i was to wear this out i think i would style it with some sort of colorful hat just kind of add some color because it is very black and white but yeah i like that a lot my personal favorite way to style this outfit is with my new jacket i am obsessed with this jacket i genuinely like can't express i've been wanting a nascar kind of style jacket for a while i found this on ebay and i won it in an auction which honestly i think it was a really good deal it honestly was so much more than i would typically spend on clothing but i decided to treat myself it looks honestly brand new here's a full 360 for you guys it also just has a satin lining and it's a very warm jacket so i can't wait to pull this out for the winter season. This double zip top is thrifted as well as these jeans. I added the newsprint covering with some like fabric transfer Mod Podge. I'm wearing the same Boohoo boots. I'm honestly not sure how realistic it is for me to wear them just because I feel like it's gonna be cold. Probably snowy and icy and I don't wanna bust my ass on campus. As far as jackets go, I envisioned it with my oversized leather jacket. Realistically, I'll have to keep this pretty zipped up just because it is going to be freezing and it's cute and comfortable and I feel like all these pieces are pretty easy to mix and match which is just nice and important when kind of creating a capsule wardrobe. The next outfit I've got my knockoff Dark Martins. These jeans that I just painted on, these cow prints. The nice thing about them is they have this kind of like stretch to them just makes them so comfortable. 
Prince little sweater that I thrifted. Again, if I was actually gonna go outside in this, I'd probably just throw on a thermal underneath. As for jackets, I feel like jackets are clearly the most important part about making cute winter outfits because if you have a wide variety, you can pretty much wear whatever as long as the jackets are nice and warm. So the options we have are again, this oversized leather jacket, or this is actually my dad's, but I'm going to borrow it for this video until I'm able to thrift my own. But it is this cool like trench coat and again because it's my dad's it's huge and it's got huge giant shoulder pads but just something about having like a longer jacket like this just like knowing that it's like very heavy and thick and will keep you warm is super nice again hats do not look as cute when you're bald let me tell you but my thing is like i can't figure out how to wear it on my head i think this is cute and man i just me and hats right now is not my favorite, but next base outfit, this white hoodie is from eBay. I've just found that having like plain white, gray, and black hoodies are super nice just because they're so easy to style and like mix and match and layer. I just recently thrifted these pants from Goodwill, but I just think they're super cute. I'm wearing these Air Maxes that I thrifted when I was in New York a while ago. As for the next layer, I really like how it looks with this denim vest that I thrifted, but I feel like again, realistically, it's not gonna be warm enough even if I did wear a layer underneath this. But I thrifted this giant denim jacket a while ago and I used to not really wear it because it was just like too big, but now I've been styling it a lot over like hoodies and I just think it looks super cool. This is just gonna be so excited to like go to school and be able to like wear cute outfits out. The next base outfit, these jeans I thrifted a while ago, they're just kind of like boot cut jeans, I'm wearing my Air Maxes, and then this Isaac crew neck, again, thrifted. And I honestly think that this would look really cute with a white turtleneck underneath, just kind of having the white peak out to match the shoes and the white on the crew neck. As for top layers, if you saw my 2021 outfits video, you know that I've really been loving denim on denim. So I decided to style these together with the same jean jacket. And I feel like this is a pretty good denim match, like color-wise, so I think it's cute. My white long sleeve is thrifted. My jeans are from the flea market. Same Air Maxes, and I am going to style it first with this little bandana top that I got from eBay. I love this little jacket so much. I think this is probably the best way to style it with just some jeans. And I could also wear it buttoned up, but it's a little bit of like a thicker material, so I think it looks better unbuttoned. And then I would probably style it just with my puffer for warmth. Actually, this looks really cute with the puffer, and it doesn't really take away from the outfit, especially because as soon as I get inside, I'll just take it off. But yeah, here's another look. Next look, my top is thrifted, my tie is from a charity shop, my boots are from Boohoo, and then my pants are part of a suit set that I got from a car boot sale. I'm struggling a bit with having my hair be cohesive with my outfits. I think for me personally, just the shaved head with the suit is like a little bit much. Even if I style it with some sort of like sequin bag like this, and I think it's like a little bit more feminine. First, I'll try it with a little bit of blazer and see. I feel like I might like this a little bit more because it's a little bit more tailored. I really like this a lot, and I definitely like it better than the suit jacket paired with the pants. This is my first kind of like comfier outfit that I feel like is a little bit more wearable for people who don't really dress up a ton. So I'm wearing these cute little velour sweatpants that are by BCBG that are thrifted. This top is from a car boot sale, so also thrifted and I'm just wearing my Air Maxes. I just know there's gonna be some mornings where I'm just not in the mood to dress up or try and tie a tie at 9 a.m. So again, I wanted to have some outfits that were more realistic. I feel like if I could find a trench coat, it would be a good option. Otherwise, it would make sense to just throw on a puffer. I feel like this is how I'm gonna end up walking to classes most days. If I'm feeling particularly crazy, I could throw on a scarf. This is one that I made from old fabric scraps. Then I'm ready for my walk to class. I don't know why, but I think the look of the scarf tucked into like a little puffer is just so cute. This next outfit, I wanted to play around with wearing some skirts and then wearing like a big long jacket as sort of like compensation. I would normally wear tights with this, but I just like could not be bothered to try on tights for this video. So imagine I'm wearing tights. My sweater is thrifted and I honestly think it's so cool. When I saw it, I was so excited because I'm not a big sweater person, but it's just like popped, obviously. Same trend you guys have seen before. And then my skirt is... I think it's by H&M, but I got it from Depop. I feel like it's fun and it's nice that it's not just the same like pants, long sleeve jacket combo that you guys have seen a million times. I finally came up with an outfit with some color. So my pink velour sweatsuit is from Goodwill. My top is from eBay and then my Air Maxes. I'd yet to try on this outfit. As you can see, there is some pink on the turtleneck, which is why I paired it with this pink sweatsuit. I don't know. I think something about the sweatsuit, like the cut is just kind of weird. I don't know. It's not exactly my favorite, but I do think it is really cute. And I feel like a lot of times when it's cold outside, everyone's go-to is just throwing on like a black jacket as I've done for the past like 18 outfits so I like this a little bit more color this next look I actually wear a lot
lot in London just because these were the pieces that I ended up bringing. But I've got this white long sleeve. Typically I style with a turtleneck and I think I actually like how the turtleneck looks better. Then I've got this little zebra top you guys have seen a million times. It's thrifted but it's by Bloomingdale's. And then my leather blazer. These wide leg pants are by BCBG but they're thrifted as well. Then I'm just wearing my Boohoo boots. I just feel like it's a pretty cute outfit and I feel like I could exchange this jacket for pretty much any other of my black jackets which is nice. And that's about all that I could come up with. Hopefully this was at all helpful and gave you some inspiration or at least it was just like fun to watch. Um, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.